Hello and welcome everyone to this quick four minute uh, overview and talk of Tribute to the Troops that aired the extended version which aired this past Wednesday night on the USA Network. Now as you can see of course I'm holding my new Intercontinental Championship belt which I have added to my collection and uh, well let's just get into the review overview shall we? I have to say that just like every year I don't have a problem with this special. I don't have a problem with this at all because it focuses on a lot of things. I mean, first of all, there's no promos. It focuses more on the action. And more importantly, they get a lot of people, celebrities, per news personalities, whatever, to come on camera, if not come with them, <coughs> excuse me, and, you know, pay their respects to the troops and for everything and everything that pay the respects to the troops for everything that they do. Um, overall the highlights of Tribute to the Troops for me uh, of course we had P. Diddy and Diddy Dirty Money with their two performances. I'm pretty sure they only did one performance during the NBC edition but during the USA edition they did two performances the first one being I'll Be Missing You a classic song which my class used as part of their theme, one of the theme songs for our graduating year as well as the new single Coming Home which was really really good they did a great job tremendous there Trace Atkins did the same thing came out did his job two songs instead of probably just one on the NBC edition very good very good uh, performances well done on behalf of both of them great job they had Cedric the Entertainer earlier in the night uh, come out and do a little bit of stand up which was good and they had Sherry Shepard out doing her Santa thing, so that everything went well. I think I think they did a pretty good job on this, and the matches were good too. Some of the matches, of course, weren't shown on the NBC edition. That weren't shown, I should say, on the NBC edition were shown on the USA edition. With I think a battle royal, the Divas matches, and I think DVRC and our truth. Uh, overall, great presentation. Never ceases to amaze how WWE does this. And that's really all I can say about it. I give it a 10 out of 10. The one thing I will note, in case you didn't see, in case you did see it on NBC as well as the USA Extended Cut, you will note this. In case you haven't seen any, if you haven't seen both of them, or if you've seen uh, just the NBC edition or the USA edition, you, I will tell you this. The only notes out of this is they edited King and Michael Cole into having them say things that updated everybody to what happened after TLC and not before. So overall 10 out of 10 show never ceases to amaze me what WWE does with this. So tell me what you guys think. God bless. Take care. Merry Christmas. Sorry this is short but I'm running out of time. Peace. I'm out.